What's up, everybody? Mary here with Mike Mahardy. Hey. You're hyperventilating already. Yeah. I'm pretty stressed out from the last episode. Uh, we are episode three of Resident Knievel. We're playing the first Resident Evil. Uh, let's see where we're at. I just... This isn't really indicative of where we are. Got the shotgun. I'm in the safe zone. I have a shotgun. Oh, I started burning bods. Uh, <laughs> which I can... I actually think is so beneficial. I should, like, start doing that more. Uh, I've used the sword key, I think, almost to the point where we don't need it anymore, which is fantastic. Mm -hmm. uh, and I got this bag of chemicals. That's new. Mm -hmm. but I, so that's what's tough about this game, right? You have to you get an item, you have no idea what it does. You have to weigh, like, should I just put it in a safe box for now, or am I going to go, like, through six hallways and then end up needing it and have to come back? Well, I feel like... If it's anything like what happened before, I'm already on caution. If I take one bite to the butt, I'm going to need a plant, and I can't even pick up a plant right now. Mm -hmm. So I feel like I'd rather put it in a safe box or one of these items in a safe box. Maybe my ink ribbons. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, because they're useless if you're not actually saving. Uh, is there a safe box in this area? Yeah, so go to your map. Any typewriter item box. Any rooms are safe. Any rooms. room that has a typewriter will also have a box. Is that what you're saying? No, no, just those ones specific. Like right now, oh, you don't have a box. Oh, I see what you're saying. So all I have to do is go through this upper blue door to the stairs. Well, that's not the upper blue door. That's the lower blue door. Oh right. But remember. Yes. So the very beginning of the game, the first zombie you saw that killed Kenneth, and then Barry killed it. Yes. If you remember that room with the crows that you went through. Yes. It went up to remember you. Okay, so remember you got that. I was telling you, you got a shortcut recently, so that'll help you get back to the safe room. You're talking about back the way I came with the evil dog. So you could go one of two ways right now. You could either go into the main hall and upstairs, so you're on the upper that circular balcony where that zombie is in the yep. dining room, or yep. you can use the shortcut with the dog. No, no, no. That's the east side. You can use that shortcut you got um, up near. I'm I'm gonna I'll tell you just so you get a better layout. Just so you understand the shortcut. I think I'm like. still after all this and we've been in a lot of places. This place is so fucking confusing. You'll yeah, you, it takes time. You'll um, start but like but when you're done you'll have it burned into your brain. And there's like a basement and there's a third floor we haven't even started on, but my second floor knowledge all right, so if we go upstairs on the balcony, do I get to the two F? You'll get to the safe room about the same time, a little faster, but uh, remember, so, okay, so, see these two red doors in the hallway? You have not tried those yet with the sword key. Right. I, well, I've just saved, so I'm okay. The I would problem is, is if I go in those rooms and there's an item, I can't get it. Right. I would recommend going just- To an item I, box. I need an item right, box. Right, I'm telling you, there's two ways to get to this one. I would recommend going through the first floor so I could show you the shortcut you opened up. So go through, like, just like as a recommendation, I would say stay on this floor, go through that way, and okay. try those locked doors. Sure. Because if one of them is a sword uh, a sword door, you'll discard the... And I just saved, so if I die, I die. Mm -hmm. I'm not... If he dies, he dies. <laughs> Do you know that movie? Um, I need more than if he dies, he... Say it again in I that voice. I break you. <laughs> Is um, it... I'm trying to think of other. <sighs> Sorry, I'm like stressed out already. Was there zombies in here? This is where you saw that first ever zombie that Barry killed. That was eating Kenneth. Right. Does um, he come back to life, or do I need to burn that guy too? Do I need to burn? No, him? he he was he walked into the dining room and Barry killed him with his magnum like a headshot. Right. Gotcha. I think that's you breathing. Yeah, it's you. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Mouth breather. <laughs> I'm trying to guide you through this, and you're insulting me. Well, fine, I, fine. I like you. I just you're also breathe heavily through your mouth. Oh, that's a dead guy. Okay, got it. Burning bodies <laughs> on a Tuesday. Actually, it's Wednesday. On a Tuesday. <laughs> yeah, it's what Saturday when we publish this, right? That's right. But it's Wednesday right now. We're specifically... Wait. He's He's gone. He just They don't disappear until you leave the area. He's just charred right now. Uh, all right. It's misleading. It's barbecue. Um, 
Yeah, I was actually going to say while I'm here because I forgot to in the last episode, if you guys like what you see here and you guys enjoy this type of stuff, please like and subscribe the video. Uh, it helps us do more uh, strange things like this that we don't get to normally do. Also, if you're like, I like this, but I wish it was, I wish I could have it on a Friday or whatever, you can let us know in the comments. Uh, it helps armor. Okay, it helps us to know when to publish these things because we don't really do a lot of long form content content so it's it's always like a a risk so so very early in the game now that you're done shilling our content very early in the game sorry <laughs> i'm just kidding somebody has to yeah um now that you're done early in the game you went down this hallway and did not like what you saw because it's the basement yes and i didn't go down or i did but I don't want to go to the basement. We well, want to stay on this floor and go to that typewriter. Well, okay. Keep in mind, you want to try as many doors as possible to get rid of the sword key if you can. It doesn't mean you have to go there. It just Because you can unlock the door and not go through it. Right. Oh. Ooh, uh. <laughs> I'm freaking out. Okay. How do I know when the sword key... Boom diggity. <laughs> now you got an empty slot. And don't have to worry about that key anymore. So I can discard it. Yeah, and you don't have to go through there. It's up to you whether you want to. I'm just saying, like, that's my point. You can unlock doors without actually entering the room. I understand. Uh, I would like to... Well, I have, an, I have a free spot now. So, see? Mm -hmm. So I, I don't mind going through it. Okay. Basements are always... Good place to be in horror games. Oh my it. god, don't. Uh... Now you're making zombie noises. You're gonna creep yourself out. Well, I know I'm not a zombie. How could you be so sure? Oh my god. I'll oh, get that HG magazine. Piece of meat. Ooh. Raccoon meat. You have a like five defensive items. You're in really good shape with that. Can you uh can you be maxed out on defensive items? I don't even know. I don't think I've ever had that many. You bet your sweet buns I'll take that magazine. I wonder if there's anything else I'm missing in here. I don't wanna check out that meat anymore, but I don't want to miss anything, so I'm gonna keep looking. Either keep, I'm keep, not a good cook, well, or they mind. got some messed up spices. <laughs> just, it's like oregano. It's, yeah, I was going to say, it's like just cilantro. <laughs> it's like, what, what is this for? Uh, this spice. These monsters. <laughs> Using basil over parsley. <laughs> uh, keep in mind, you can check your map, and it'll tell you uh, like 100% or in progress or 100%. Right, right, right. That's smart. Well, it's, it's blinking green. What does that mean? I think that means I'm done. All right, so I just tried this uh, door that looks like an oven, and it didn't work. There's also another red door. In this creepy little hallway to the back. With a creepy hallway. Yikes. All right, let's do it. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, okay. I have a thing. Burn that fucker. Burn him. Oh, I want to watch him burn. Okay, we can watch it. Nice. Oh wait, I fucked up. <laughs> I wanted you to watch it. Can I get hurt? Yes. A little bit. Cool. Um, cool. It's an elevator, which is... The power doesn't seem to be turned on. After watching the zombie burn, I'm turned on. Anyway, that's the basement. So... <laughs> <gasps> no. Das cutscene. Why? No. 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 What's happening? No. 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 <gasps> Don't fall. It's like Terminator 2 when she's back. Um, Shoot it. Her name is back in the folly. Ah! Ah! I would actually encourage you to use a defensive item right here. You have a lot. But I don't want I don't want to get eaten. How do I how do I use it? 
Never mind, just shoot him. No, how do I use it? Just I'm make, genuinely just have asking him you. Go up to him and have him grab you. Just do not let him grab you from behind, otherwise you can't. Use I see. So I want him to grab me, but I, he can't grab my back. Right. And so I just just stand and, and let him. And you know I'll in. use it. I I mean you could shoot him still. Like I would. You I have wanna... you have a good amount of. There you go. Do I use it? Yep. So it's not gonna, that won't kill him, but um, I would let just let him get up. I wouldn't, um, or you could shoot downward at him if you want. I would oh wait! Him, I would let him come at you. Oh wait! This He's got him. Should save you a few rounds. Ah, uh, you know what? So if you had gotten a headshot by chance, you would have been able to get the dagger back. Ah. Uh, but, but there's. He's up. Stay down. Oh, you don't have fuel either. I, I know. Should, I should have told you to walk up and let it cur her curb stomp him. No, you're fine. You still only use it three rounds as opposed to, like, potential seven. Yeah, I don't have any, uh, I don't have any fucking fuel. Yeah, that's fine. Well, what if he becomes a redhead? He might, but at least you eradicated the other one. One's better than two. <sighs> All right, so, sorry, let me do this thing that I have gotten really used to doing. Mm -hmm. So the sword key's gone, which is good. Okay, a, so it I clears need up your inventory, and B, you know you've used, you've unlocked all the doors you can at this point. So now you need, one, I need the to get armor out. or the helmet. So key. I'm getting out of the basement. I need an armor, helmet key. I need to turn on the power to the elevator. Um, oh, and I need, uh, our original task was to get, excuse me, there we go, to get to that item box, mm -hmm. to get rid of some stuff that I don't need right now, because I have too much stuff. Mm-hmm. Also, I don't know if you remember one of your overarching objectives right now. Do you remember the four masks they mentioned? Yes. Yeah, you're also kind of looking for those, but you'll come across those. I feel like I'll worry about that more when I get there. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I'm still, I still don't understand this area very well. So I'm going to go all the way to the end of this hallway. Yeah, that's where you first saw that zombie. He was eating Kenneth. Right. Of course, Kenneth. Mm -hmm. Of course. The zombie's name was Barbie. <laughs> Open windows creep me out in this game. Do I need to burn him too, eventually? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're not talking on purpose. That's important. <laughs> Anytime I'm not talking, it's weird. <laughs> they just don't shut up. <gasps> oh, oh my god. Oh my god. No. Oh my god, not the cross. Oh, right. That window behind you is creeping me out. Shut up. <laughs> I hate those crows. Should I use a plant? <laughs> um, what's your inventory looking like? Oh, it's uh, I got one slot. Yeah, take it with you. Cause like I'm on. Well, caution. you don't have to use it. You could just still bring it back to your. I would just take it, and if you don't get hit, just keep it in your safe box for potential like red herb down the what road. What do you mean if I don't get hit? I'm saying ideally you won't get hit, so then you could just instead of using that. I don't, I don't like your attitude. <laughs> <laughs> so when you uh, go up, you you've been through here. Keep in mind. So I'm going up the stairs, mm -hmm. and then I'll have to figure it out because I can't remember past them. Shut up. Shut up. They sound awful. I hate crows. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Fuck, I can't burn so any of these bods. Okay, but remember I was telling you you unlocked that shortcut last episode. <sighs> Whereas previously the two doors down this hallway were broken. Okay, so let me let me try to If you go all the way down that hallway, if I take a right. See the dining room at the bottom left of the map? Mm. Yeah. See those two blue doors, the north end of the dining room? Remember you you originally went out that one and then back in the other to get to the safe room. You unlock that shortcut this time, so you're literally right next to the door that leads to the hallway with the safe room right now. Uh, if I go in here? Yes. That's that one you unlocked last time. Okay, so I, all I, I just need to do is take a right through this hallway. Mm -hmm. and, and hope hope those bodies don't reanimate. Jesus. And if they do, just... <laughs> See... So remember, this is this is a pretty good shortcut, actually. You don't have... It's, it's not super useful. You just get to avoid the upper floor of the balcony. Uh, dining room, sorry. So I and then so like go down to the first floor map. See the safe room's like pretty much under you right now. Right, but I still gotta get there. So all I have to do is take these stairs down. Mm -hmm. This is the medical safe room. Oh my god! Isn't there a zombie in here? 
You burned one of them. No, you burned a couple of them. I can't even remember. You're also near that room with more uh, kerosene. <laughs> they always this put a zombie outside in door. there. No, no, no. This is a safe room. There's never a zombie in a safe room. But there was a zombie right outside this room. Oh, yeah. That, yeah he was. I thought I burned that fucker. I'm going to leave this up to you, what you leave and what you take. I feel like I need everything else. Don't you think? Okay, so... What would you say is the next, like, up... What, what's... If you could get one item right now to help you in the game, what would it be? Um, the armor key. Okay. Um... Do you remember reading Oh, anything? the dog whistle. There you go. Nice. Okay. And, it, uh, you know, like, assuming it is a feral dog, the shotgun is going to be useful to have. Right. The pistol doesn't knock them back. It damages them. I'd like to be fully healed before I take on any more did dogs. You, did you put the ink ribbons back? Yes. Okay. Do you think I need them? Should I save? No, no, no. no. Uh, I'm just trying to think. Where is... Um, Do you remember where they said the dog was? Yeah, it was in the second... Oh, my God. Hold on. I'm sorry. I have anxiety. I'd like to get more kerosene. Yeah, do yeah, that that room's right here. Down the hallway. Is it to the right? Mm-hmm. It's the adjacent room of the save room. <laughs> Those windows always creep me out. Oh, I hate windows. After that dog jumped through there, I'll never forget that. Ugh. The dog biting me in the butt though, that was like exceptionally upsetting. Mm -hmm. Okay. Give me that kerosene. So honestly, I know this is like not the most interesting, but what I'd like to do is I'd like to refill my canteen, burn that zombie that's right outside of the safe room, come back and get more kerosene, and then burn those bodies that are in the thing that are right next to me. I'd like to burn every body that's near me. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. It's going to conserve ammo down the road. It's, there is the possibility that they could already turn into crimson heads, but no, 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 you're accepting that risk when you burn them right now. So that's just what the game is. I have no problem with your philosophy right now. Don't be crimson. <laughs> burn, baby, burn. Disco, fire now. Oh, yeah, burn. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I like this image. Genuinely creepier than anything happening in the game when I make those noises. All right, so he won't be there when I come back? Correct, oh, wait. Correct a move, So there's though. two... Sorry, excuse me. I know this is, like, not the most interesting thing to watch, but I think this is important. No, that's the game. So I'm going to... Surviving. I'm going to go back, refill my canteen. There's two zombs right where I was. I'm going to I'm going to burn them now and I'm going to even go back and get kerosene a, a third time mm -hmm. just because I'd rather have it and Yeah, it makes sense. Like there's no reason There's no reason not to. Mhm. Mm no, I like the way you're thinking. Cuz you don't want to fight crimson heads if you can help it. They're stronger like they take more bullets? They take more bullets. They will be more aggressive and they're faster. They're like, uh, they're like World War Z zombies as opposed to Night of the Living Dead zombies, if that makes sense. Wait, which door was it? Is this one, right? Mm -hmm. You'll be standing on him when you go through. Oh God, I hope he's not a crimson head. No, 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 no. Come on, give me a break. Come on. And then there's one here. Ah! 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 Run! <laughs> you did that on purpose. <laughs> did you know that was gonna happen? Yeah, I knew. I need you to do it. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, it's good you escaped. Just remember he's there, waiting to eat your face. <laughs> So do you remember what's up those stairs, like where he just was, that the other door? Remember that's where that first, uh, that's where you put the replica key in place of the um, sword key. That would have killed you with those statues if you didn't. Right, right. Which, what am I doing? Oh, I'm going down. Okay. God, this place is so confusing. All right, so now I gotta get more kerosene. 
Should I oh, just... Actually, I'm curious. Did that use your um, fuel? It did not. Okay. I checked. That was like my first... My The first thing I thought of was, that shit better not waste yeah. kerosene, because that's horse shit. Mm -hmm. Use a little bit of, tiny bit of the Zippo fuel, though. I have Zippo fuel? Well, in your lighter. I don't know if it's a Zippo. I doubt it is. Zippos were really popular because they, uh, that brand gave a bunch of lighters to uh, the army. Uh, so, like, a bunch of army people had Zippos, and then that became, like, the standard lighter to have during like world war ii yeah it was like really smart it's like probably like the best marketing thing they ever did also it was just really nice of them was it world war ii that m m started or world war one because they literally to ship them they needed a shell around it so they wouldn't melt the chocolate all right i think it was world war two uh, one i think that sounds They've like been a, around a while that sounds like a two thing because world war one like you're talking old school m m's although m m's are pretty old we'd have to look it up mm -hmm. all right should i take care of that Redhead, or should I do it later? No, don't worry about him. I'll tell you that. You would want shotgun rounds to take care of him. Oh, really? He's mm -hmm. that tough? It's not that they're tough. It's you need the knockback. So they. I mean, you have a lot of defensive items. You could. Uh, you will be back there. Um, so don't worry about it right now. All right. Well, I guess, to be honest with you, I'm not really sure where to go then. Because, okay. oh, oh, the dog whistle is right. the next scene. Do you remember so, where they said the, that area second was? Second floor east? That's my... Wait, actually, is there a way? Hold on. Go back to... My items? Yeah, your inventory. Go to files. Uh, okay. And then uh, you can reread memos. Oh, right. Good call. Good call. Um, Crumbled memo, maybe? I think that's right. Mm. There you go. Second floor balcony on the west side of the terrace. Okay. So, I am on the second floor, and I need to go to the west side balcony. Is that talking about this? No, that's the uh, crow room. Okay. Um, where's the west side balcony? Because um, I'm on the second floor. Mm -hmm. So, it's like right here. Is it this room? No, no. It's, it's the perimeter of the mansion, so... Um. Boom, there you go. Yeah, that door to the uh um, the, I'm like, the like circumference of the uh Now listen. Room. Excuse me while I readjust. It's the lockpick door that I don't know if you unlocked it yet, but it's a lockpick door to get out. Okay. It's that like garden door. I would like to refill my health to max. And I would like to equip my shotgun. Does that seem reasonable? Mhm. Mm What's your health Aaron? It's at caution. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. No, yeah, do what you want. I'm just thinking ahead. Good. Yeah, you're in good shape. Oh! Oh, there's two of them. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't, don't. No. Ah, uh, shit. Okay, you got a defensive item. Use a defensive item. Use it. I would. Okay. Uh, do not use Let, shotgun shells right now. Let's think about this. Why? Because, okay, here's here's what I want you to do. Just so you know, I was totally going to, and I hit the wrong button and opened my map instead of shooting him. It's all right. Which is good, because now you have, okay, so I'm you have defensive, defensive items. Item. Just don't let him grab you from behind. Uh -huh. When you use the defensive item, then you have six extra shotgun shells in your city. I would encourage you to try to use the pistol once okay. he's down. It's, it's not guaranteed to knock him down, but you have enough defensive items that... So I need to re-equip once I use this defensive item. Or just... Because yeah, I have my yeah, shotgun though. Oh. Or just run. No, no, no. Don't even worry Oh, about no. It. They oh, both fuck. open. Go, 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 go. Go through there. Oh. <laughs> Shit. They both reanimated. Yeah, so the, the you wouldn't have been able to burn them anyway. They would have done that. Um. See, that's why I didn't want to use the green herb. There's some right here that you can use. You're fine, though. You're good. Shut up. You'll... Go, when you go back through there later, you'll... Do I want my shotgun equipped or not? This yeah, This is the west do. wing, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, the West Terrace. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I'm I'm just thinking out loud. <laughs> so am I. Ooh. Oh, I I don't want these yet, right? You you can't use them. You don't pick them up. This just refills your health. They're like it's a garden, not necessarily one green herb. I didn't know that. I know. 
I didn't want to just tell you that was coming though. You're uh, fine. You're really you're good. There are enough herbs lying around. So there's permanent. There's permanent. There's only okay. There's only enough for a few uses. No, because I don't need it. Correct. They let you eat herbs when you're at full health? This game is mean. Well, yeah, sometimes that's a strategy to get rid of item slots. Uh, all right. Let me collect my bearings here. I need to use this dog whistle. Mm -hmm. Should I use it here? Should I use it by the door so I can jump, get out? If you know you're going to be fighting a dog, I would try to find a more open area to maneuver. Could there already be dogs in here? There could be, but I was just saying either way, I, don't, I wouldn't want to fight a dog in this. Ah! What angle was that? Actually, I guess you want to like enclose. No, yeah, you'll just keep. This area is pretty big. Have I been here before? No. So do you see that door at the end? Yep. Where that's going to go? You're going back to the safe. So you know when you go through that door, you'll be safe. Theoretically, as long, unless they put like zombies in the main hall. But I need a key to get in there, which the dog has. No, no, no. That's one of the doors that was locked from the other side, and now you're on the other side. Should I just open it now? Eh, I should just get the key. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Fucking dog. So what, from my perspective, when I'm fighting a dog, I want the camera angle to be wide enough that by the time I even see him near me, mm -hmm. I can like aim and kill him. So like this Good area call. seems nice mm -hmm. because I could like dodge and aim and kill him. Mm -hmm. Does that sound right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Fuck. All right. All right. I'm going to use it. I feel good. You feel good? Mm -hmm. Okay. Here we go. I feel good. Oh. Oh no, he got me! <laughs> I was trying to shoot him. He was faster than me. Mash the. Yeah, there you go. I got him. Nice. <gasps> Try it. Get, get the collar. <clears throat> Should I burn the, bo the dogs? Dogs don't come back to life, right? Yeah, you're fine. There's don't no crimson dog? Fuck, am I in danger? Oh, you kill that in one. No, no you're caution. good. Okay. Actually, I mean, you kill both of them. I would just recommend going to use that green That green plant, bed. the permanent plant? Mm -hmm. Perm plant? Mm -hmm. They cannot reanimate. Correct. All right. Even if they could, you'd have to leave. If they were regular zombies and they were bleeding, you'd have to leave and then come back for them to do so. Okay. Oh, oh. Those moths. I'm waiting for trip dog. Cerberus? Just three dogs. Cerberus is like a whole other thing. What is three dogs? Oh, he's from Fallout 3, the, the radio host. Enough po pop culture references. I don't know if you call Greek mythology pop culture, but yeah, you're good. I wouldn't. You're back in the green. Yo, G up. <laughs> That's what I call using herbs. G and up. Hey, I'm trying to guide you through. I'm going to recommend some lingo, too. It's not yeah, my I fault. didn't say anything. I didn't come up with it. I just observed you. Capcom. Cautiously, like Capcom this. Capcom has said that's what they call using green herbs. All right. G'ing up. All right. I don't think that that's official. Most most slang isn't. I I don't think anybody's ever. What? It's asking to discard the uh, dog whistle. You don't need it anymore. Okay. So now you free up a slot. Sweet. So. Okay, cool. Great. So, I just have a collar. What am I supposed to do with that? Or you can examine items. Right. Also, also earlier in this episode, I said that you have already done something that you have not. You're about to. Ooh. Can I? I just want to see something real fast. Is it, can I just see what the emblem is? Could it be by that door? Um, the one that said the Spencer emblem. Yes. The lion door. Yes. Is that a lion? No. Should I just press it and see what happens? Yeah. 
put the collar on and then press it to see what happens. It just I'm kidding. It just severs your head. I don't I'm kidding. <sighs> <laughs> yeah. Should I save? No, just I'm telling you, press it. Oh, mercy. So, do you see what it's called? The armor key. No, no, no. Yeah, read that. Oh, I can zoom in. Lacks the rigidity. Don't. I got this. So this harkens back to the first episode we recorded. Lacks the rigidity? What the fuck does rigidity. that Rigidity. I don't know what that means. Just like stiffness. It's to not be just key enough? Yeah. But it's imitation of a key. Okay. I don't know if you, like, so we recorded the first episode a week ago. Can I replace a key with it? Like, should I be replacing the key from the other key? You're on the right track. Okay. I'm, I made should like I use I'm, the fertilizer on the key and grow a key? <laughs> yeah, do that. Um, I think you know what you're doing. I just think you forgot where it was. Remember I said, like, have you seen Raiders of the Lost Ark? When he replaces the thing with the thing yes. for the weight. You might not remember where this was, though. Do you, I, just, do you recall? On. There was this long string of suits of armor hallway. And that was the one where, like, it was on the first floor. It was in this, this area. It was in this area. Yes, it's on the west side. Okay. It was f fairly early on, like very early on. <sighs> okay, so I want to go downstairs. Okay. Mm. I want to save. Well, if you want to save, then the quickest way to save room is through these doors. And then around the balcony of the dining room, and then through the... I was going to say go downstairs. Oh, to the typewriter in the dining room. But you, you don't have ink ribbons, though. Oh, you're right. While you're here, so I want to go backwards. Yeah. Oh my but God! There, there where's the crimson heads? <laughs> yeah, there are two crimson heads in your way. I have two shotgun shells. And you've got defensive items. I would encourage you to try not to use shotgun shells, but you've got defensive items. I can't take out crimson heads with defensive items. It's not gonna kill them, but it'll help. It could. I mean, theoretically, it could. If it's I have to kill them, or I'm wasting my time. Remember. Right. If yeah. I don't kill them, then go they go just to your defensive items. Actually, switch to the stun gun because that does more damage. I only have one though. Yeah, no, it'll it'll automatically go to the uh, daggers if you use the stun guns. Did I pick it? No. There you go. Okay. So you do have six extra shotgun shells. So I'm going through this main blue door here. Yes. Mm -hmm. So right behind me, mm -hmm. and there's two crimsons in there, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna kill them. Actually, yeah, go through there. So here's what here here are two options. To get back to the safe room, you're gonna have to go past two crimson heads to get down the stairs to the safe room, or you could use that shortcut you unlocked to just you could uh, the door to the right on the upper what? balcony. Go go into the dining room and then I'll explain it. Just remember that zombies up here. There's two zombies in there. No, up in this room, there's that one that you uh, don't have to kill at all. It's around the circular. Just go in. You don't, don't recognize the room. I'm uncomfortable. I'm confused. <coughs> the layout of the rooms. <coughs> I remember this one. Oh my god, I'm turning into a zombie. Don't. <laughs> all right, so. Uh, I wouldn't walk this way. I would circle the balcony first. Why? He's not there. He's going to be. He's there. So. Which door am I trying to get to? The left one or the you right one? You could do one? either. So, um, 
I will tell you, if you go through the right one, that's toward the key, the uh, armor key. But if you go through but the left I one... I want to save. So the two crimson heads are pretty much right on the other side of that left door. That's also where you, the door, you, right near the door, you used to get on the west terrace. So I need to go through those crimson heads to save. If you go through the right door, there's going to be a crimson head as well, because that's the one that you like walked on. You tried to So let both him. require horseshit. Yeah. Well, I probably want to do the left one and take out the two crimson heads so I can get to the save. I would try to avoid them if possible. It's going to be tough, but yeah, yeah, yeah. You want me to avoid them? Now, when I do that, I go downstairs, right? But here, here's my thing. If you avoid them, go downstairs and save. You're going to have to encounter them again because you're going to have to come back up. Right. The key that you're trying to get is up here. So my suggestion would be to, um, to oh. not do that. What? But then if I die, I have to redo all this. You're going to have to go through them no matter what to get to the save room. I would... Okay, here's... Here's my thing. Okay, no, I, I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. You're not going to save for a little bit, uh, okay? okay? Well, I'll guide you through it, though. Go through the right door. You're going to have to encounter one crimson head. Okay. This I mean, way... You want me to use one of my items? If po Avoid him or, yeah, use a defensive item and then your okay. pistol. Don't waste any shotgun. And items. then where am I going once I get in that room? Um, the left those, stairs those or the right the stairs? The right stairs. You'll recognize where you are once you get there. It's just... Okay. Come this way, stupid. Where is he? Where is he? He's, I mean, he's good. He so he's not near? Through. He might be near it, but you can get through. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so there's a crimson in here. On the, yeah, toward the end of the hallway. Okay. This is where you got the arrowhead. <sighs> a lot of these places have only been once. It's like really conf this is a hallway? Mm hmm You'll recognize it. Um, and there's a crimson in here? Shit. So I'm taking a left, down this hallway, and then I'm taking a right, and then another right. Mm -hmm. And I gotta kill a crimson head. Mm-hmm. Okay. Or you don't have to kill him, but you could. He, he might be easier to avoid than... Oh my god, that's him. Yeah, I would say use your pistol and a defensive item, and you should be good. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bait him down this hallway so you can get a few shots in. He's fast, though, so... He'll be fine. Can he see me? I don't know. I love that shot, though. Sorry, I shouldn't be paying attention to the sh shot composition right now. He's not coming. You could theoretically dodge him. I would say just Are go. You go saying no, no, I would say go for the dodge anyway, because the worst case scenario, he grabs you as long as it's not from behind. Use a defensive item. Right, I understand what you're saying, because all I have to do is jump into this hallway real quick and take a right and mm -hmm. go down those stairs. Yeah, my here's my thing though. If you do use a defensive item and he falls, don't waste that. Shoot him a few times on the ground. I understand. <laughs> Did I do it? There you go. He hit me. Sun gun. But hey, he you're hit good, me. You're good. You're good. Okay, sh shoot him. Wait, I get. Hold on, yeah. There you go. Sweet. Okay, killed him. That's why the stun gun was good. You did get hit, but you're probably in the yellow. I don't. How did I get hit though? He just—he didn't grab you. He swung. They sometimes do that. I just didn't. Yeah, it didn't really. You're good. You're still fine. It didn't hurt you at all. That's weird. Lucky for you. Oh, I need to burn him. All you use are the. No, 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 no. Crimson heads don't reanimate. That's the last, the final form. Okay. So he will disappear when you come back through. Cool. That worked out way better than I thought. That was why the stun gun was better than the daggers. Should I take this plant? What's your inventory looking like? I got two spaces. Uh, yeah, you might as well try to start hoarding those in your safe box. Okay. Um, if you're gonna go to a save room after this, I would just take both of them. I oh okay. No 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 no. Sorry, don't. You can't. You need to uh to take one for now. Why? I I'm going to a safe room. You'll be coming back, but just remember remember what you're doing with the key. You need to be able to pick up something while before you replace. I it. I thought I was gonna go to the safe room before that happens. Is that not the case? No, okay. I'm telling you, you'll be fine. You'll you'll recognize this room. I'm, the armor key opens a lot of the mansion. Oh, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> that, like, Goku noise you make. Just checking the layout. It appears there's stairs in front of you. And cobwebs. Okay. Shattered memories. Shut up. You remember this? Yes. Mm -hmm. So, 
It looks like I could replace that key with a key. Boom diggity. <sighs> this is when I brought up Raiders of the Lost Ark. Should I run? Should I get prepped to run? No, no. I mean, no, you don't need to if you're replacing it. I bet if I Okay. Should I take it and then immediately use the other one? Mhm. Mm There's no like option to replace. No, no, no. You'll be fine. I know what your concern is. That's that was mine when I first did it too, but you'll be able to replace it. It gives you time to react, like more than enough time. Oh. oh my god. Make sure you put the right one. There you go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I love the little like shards of floor or wall, the plaster that came off. So it kind of hints that those are going to come in if you're paying attention, I guess. Which you never would have been able to do that in the first on play PS1. Oh my head. That's so stressful. I got a key. I'm on examine it. Okay. Armor key. There's that rigidity you were looking for. Rigidity. The rigidity. I lost my rigidity. My rigidity. <laughs> to a key in the attic. All right. <laughs> I I would like to save. I've done a lot of good stuff. Mhm. Mm um Can I use should I just go down that red door? So You have two options. You can either go the long route. Oh, I love options. You can either fight two crimson heads, which with the shotgun ammo you have right now, I would not recommend. Uh huh. Or you could go the long way to the other save room in the east wing and go save there. Uh huh. Which that's I would recommend that. Uh huh. Because you don't have a ton of shotgun ammo and whatnot. Uh huh. So, what about this red door down here? You could try it save out. And it? I could save you time. It's not a armor. Okay. Door. So. So now you're pretty much just opening armor doors. Which, if you don't remember where they are, that's fine. Just trial and error. Right. Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. There's always a, like one or two. But I before I even do that, I would like I would like to yeah, freaking and I, say. And I would highly recommend going to the east one because there are two crimson heads circling the corridor above. Right. And you don't have a shortcut right now that will, you can get to the lower west save room without So what's going the quickest through. way to get to the east then? Just backtrack to the dining room balcony and then main hall and then... Um, through the upper floors. All right. Because keep in mind, there are dogs prowling the east first floor, which you can avoid now. You just have to go through the second floor. It's going to take longer, but it's worth it. You're you, in the long run, you'll save way more ammo. And I'll be s <laughs> alive. And you'll you have more chance of surviving. Yeah. It's just it's going to take a little bit longer. Yeah. This is a good time for me to remember where the fuck I am. All right. So I want to go. Am I going to the first floor? Or do I want to go no, to the, the second? Okay, so I'm going to take a left here and go down to this open area mm -hmm. with the zombie that I can dodge really easily. Mm -hmm. I would you could And bring then go into the main area and go downstairs. Yeah, and you could bring a couple herbs with you right now too. They're sitting there. Or one or whatever. We stock up on them. Okay, I understand. <gasps> I understand why you wouldn't let me take two herbs now. You would have died. Not you wouldn't know. You wouldn't have even been able to pick up the key. I understand. Okay, so I'm going down this hall. Mm -hmm. <gasps> <laughs> Stop! You were getting far too calm. I couldn't have that. Oh, mercy. <laughs> Alright, going straight. Prepare to dodge zomb. Sorry, no matter how many times I do this, I keep getting confused. I think this one's an armor, but I'm not going to go in it yet because I want to save. You can try it out. Re remember, if it is an armor door. Oh, right. So you ha you literally you have to be on the other side to unlock that one. Got it, got it, got it. All right, so there's a zombie. Close. Where are you at? Where are you at? Where are you at? Weep. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. I told you to go left. Early. You did. All right, cool. Episode dose. So I want to go here.
Man, this is a puzzler. Mm -hmm. It's way more of a puzzle game than I thought. Yeah, there's a lot of forethought involved with the early Resident Evil games. With the early Resident Evil games. <laughs> um, okay, so I'm going down. No, no, no. I would say the first floor has a dog on it that you could avoid if you stand second. Right. It would have had two dogs if you hadn't killed that other one on the terrace with the uh, herbicide that you got. Okay. So I'm going through this door? This yeah, floor. you're you're aiming for those stairs on the north side. Are there any dogs in here? Not on the second floor, no. On the first floor, yeah, but that's why I'm telling you to stay on the second. Right. So I'm going through this hallway, and I'm going to take a right at the end of the hallway mm -hmm. through that green door. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to go through that other blue door and go down the stairs. Yes. Okay. I just like game plans because it makes me feel better. Mm-hmm. I feel way more comfortable knowing. Hey. <laughs> oh my god! Actually, one. No. Just tr no. I have a game plan. We decided. I'm gonna on save you time. We decided on game plan. Okay. 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 No. What? No, we have time. We've got. We've got more. What time. time are you gonna save me? I would say use this, go through this door right now. Wait, let me see your inventory, actually. I'm full. Never mind. You can't. Okay, never mind. At least unlock this door. Okay. There you go. You don't have to go through it, though. <laughs> it's the last one. Mm hmm. Okay. <sighs> I wonder when those crows are going to come into play. I feel like you don't have. Loud fucking... Oh, sorry. It wasn't the last... It, this works, too. Just go through the other side of this room. Do you know what I mean, though? You, like, you don't have loud crows unless they're going to kill you at some point. Maybe I, the developers realize that it's unsettling and put them in there for for no reason at all. Maybe mm -hmm. they realize that just having a narrative to why the crows are there is unsettling or is settling and comforting. Maybe they realize that making sense of things is the only way we can avoid discomfort and they want to cause discomfort. No, I don't believe you. <laughs> Okay, what am I doing? Um, so I went down right these there. stairs, just like we discussed. Mm -hmm. And you're there, pretty much. Oh, and I just go to this blue door right here? Mm, yeah, to, to the right. The, to, to the top. The the bottom is the one that you used twice. Wait, wait, read that. Oh, is that new? Mm-hmm. 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 Love. He's a redhead. No, we don't like redheads. <laughs> All right. A bunch of first aid sprays, some incendiary rins for your grenade launcher, which you don't have yet. What a nice guy. All right. I'm just going to... You can't yeah, do that. Without... Really? <clears throat> it's weird because I can combine other things. Yeah, but you can combine two green herbs and it makes something different, and I don't think they want you to do that in the actual save box. Yeah, I would recommend putting those in the save box so they will be in any other save room you go to. Have I have we talked about that? How if you put something into a save box, it's in all the save boxes in the game? I made that assumption based mm. on my history of playing video games. Okay, but there Wait, is, I can't there take is it? A, So these don't double either? No. It's fucking stupid. This game. Yeah. Because I can do it with these. With handgun ammo, yeah. So. But but you can't, like... I don't know. First aid sprays are way bigger than bullets. <laughs> nah. Than magazines? Not really. <laughs> Logic. Should I keep a, sp I would a sprizzle with me? Dump two slots right now. Get rid of the ink ribbons for now. Just put those in the box and then go save. It's annoying. I realize that, but... What? Dump the ink ribbons right now. I and can't save without them. I know. Put those in the box. Pick up the incendiary grenades and the first aid spray. Put those back in the box just so you have them in the box. Not to worry about it anymore. Okay, I understand. And then save. I understand. Okay, I get what you mean. It's just so you don't have to... Yeah, yeah I got it. That way, if I die, I don't have to do this again. Correct. I understand. So... Tell me this, do incendiary shells, uh, if I kill the zombie with them, do they already, they're already on fire, which means I won't get a crimson head? Theoretically, um, I would save the shells for bigger enemies than just zombies, though. There's bigger enemies than zombies? 
Yes. That wasn't like a dismissive laugh. It felt dismissive. Sorry, I apologize. (laughs) You jerk. You rookie. No, uh, yeah, no, just take the ingredients. Oh. There are, there are numerous kinds of enemies. God. Making good progress. Saving is the only thing that makes me happy. Mm Mm-hmm. You do know you can only save eight times in this game. And you're at six right now. And you have another, like, four hours. You can't overwrite saves in this game. Yes, you can. No, you can't. No, I'm just kidding. But part of you believed me. No, I didn't. No, no part What's of What's your fuel me? looking like? My fuel? Oh, mm-hmm. I have two. Okay, cool. Alright. So, with the time we have left for this episode, I, I would say that door you unlocked on the second floor... Yeah, let's go through it. Yeah, go through that. Man, I have like a freaking head. I would pick that up just so you have it. And okay. then you, when next time you save, you can bring it back. I have a headache from like... Shit, we should, probably shouldn't have even saved just now. You Why? have enough increments. Just because we're going to save again in 10 minutes. You have enough increments though, you're good. There's, You will probably finish the game like with six extra increments or so. It's this way, right? Yeah. That's the way you came through. Right. Yes. Isn't that what we're doing? Because we're going through this door. Mm-hmm. So I, oh, I could also go through here is what you're saying. That's faster, yeah. Okay, let's do that. And you also can't go through that door to your right. It's like locked from the other side all I the just time. don't want you to do that thing where you're like, you can only go through that door one no, it'll, more time. No, it'll like prompt you and say this door now is falling apart. No. <laughs> okay. You ready for some puzzles? Oh, oh my god. Oh. Okay. Woe to those who disturb my sleep. Press button to disturb. (laughs) There's a switch here. Um, I think I I just like to look around real fast before I press buttons. Mm Mm-hmm. I can move these. Mm hmm. Okay. Okay. So. I can move them, but where? Um, all right. This kind of seems like the kind of. Th- um. Okay. So this guy's. C- can I move him? Move them back. Back where they came. Oh, he didn't like that. Did not like, did not care for that. <laughs> uh, all right. Uh, I'm learning. Don't, don't give anything away. Can I move them this? Can I move them this way? Okay. Interesting. Can I pull them? Um, One would think. I don't think this game allows you to, though. This is an ocarina of time. Oh, but that one didn't move backwards. I find that really interesting. This one moved and this one didn't. Um, does this stuff on the wall have anything to do with it? I haven't put it together yet, uh, but I'm going to continue to move them backwards and see what happens. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. How about this one? I don't think you pushed them all the way. Oh. Okay, I can only have one backwards. No. No. All three of them are backwards. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Just kidding. Just kidding. There's an order that I need to do this. Is that what's happening? Try that. 
I'm just speaking out loud. Yeah, there is. Certainly. I would like to. I'd li I'd rather die. All right. So, shield. Uh, axe, sword, pike. Right. I will say that of all the times I play the game, I've never taken the time to actually figure out what they're trying to tell me. I just do trial and error. Do you know what the objective is right now? My objective might not be the game's objective, but my objective is to get them all backwards, mm -hmm. uh, which I would consider their sleep state. And certain pushing certain ones is like reverse is moving certain ones. That's right. So ideally, you would want to have like, say the shield. This isn't the case, but say the shield knight will always move the sword knight to the opposite side. You would want the shield knight and the sword knight out. So when you push the, sh <laughs> yeah, leave the room. Yeah, don't press that until you figure it out. Well, <laughs> I didn't want to listen to you anymore. <laughs> oh, okay. Fine, figure it out yourself. Oh, no, I'm almost dead. Yeah, too bad. I hope you die. <laughs> I'm going to laugh when you die. Should I use a herb? Probably. Or just, mm, just figure out the puzzle without... Dying? Mm-hmm. It would be funny if the gas was still pumping in all right so I'm almost dead here we go shield axe sword pike thing I'm not sure if those are the actual names of the weapons I'm doing my best here wait Wait, remember what the push in the shield knight did? It made that guy go backwards. Mm -hmm. Cuz like I honestly have never figured out what they're trying to tell me with these. I just do trial and error. Or, like, I try to figure out what... Yeah. I really don't think the wall is telling you much, and if it is, I don't think it's that useful. Fuck! <laughs> I'm going around in circles. Try the... Other guy. Pike Knight, yeah. Okay. So remember the shield won't do anything. So I want to do that or, one last. Yeah. No, the shield one makes that guy go. Oh wait, so maybe you were, yeah. No, this guy makes this guy go. You're right. Shield made that guy go. Yes. Well. <laughs> Let's hope. Hope this goes. Uh, hope this goes well. That'd be funny if you just wanted them to be out. Sick. You guys are dumb. Did it. <laughs> I would like to examine the yeah, box. Examine that cheese. Oh my god. <laughs> I just want to take a good look at it. Sunshine will awaken me. Oof. Mm. Um Okay. We'll go back to the top. These are all switches. We'll go back to the top of the box and sunshine will open it. 
Right. Uh, all right. Okay. Sunshine is two halves of a heart. And the moon are two rectangle things. So I want... I want to open these. Did I do it? Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, that's one of the four. Mm -hmm. Cool. Ooh. So you're making progress on that front, too. What do you mean there's nothing unusual? <laughs> what the fuck is that? A death mask. There's nothing unusual about it. My mom got me one for my birthday. Mm -hmm. She came into my bedroom in the morning wearing one. <laughs> for a mask, it doesn't have eye holes. It had a. It was a, a mask of my brother's face. Oh my god! Turns out it was my brother's face. He's S dead. Well, he's alive. He just doesn't have a face. So is it really him? Ugh, so that I'm might almost, be a good place to save and call it. I'm almost dead. Should I use some health? Mm, no, you can get back to the save room without any encounters. I hope you can. You're pretty close to a save room right now. Yeah, I'm very close. So foreboding seeing those doors. Down the stalls. There's loud thunder. Thunder scares me in real life, too. Well. Should I heal before I save? That way I'm healed next time we start. Mm. I'm not going to start. Yeah, if you're going to heal, though, I'd use a first aid spray. Not. Why? Because you could save that green herb later for a red oh, herb. Oh, for a red herb. I understand. Death mask I would recommend not carrying right now. Because you need four later on. Oh, I can't put it in now? You could. I mean, just right if you want to save it on the episode, I would say just... Man, this is exciting. I have, um... Nice. Yeah, I mean, it w instead of taking all four masks later on to go do that, it would be nice to periodically. Oh, I forgot to get it. Right, I understand what you're saying. I thought maybe it would give me something if I put one mask in. Oh, I see what you're saying. That was pretty good. Mm -hmm. Got a lot accomplished. I used to listen to the song to fall asleep when I was young. <sighs> I was a really old geek. This and uh, what's that world in Super Mario 64? The Lagoon. Oh yeah, uh, you're talking about. I don't know. Yeah, for the one with with the eel in the ship. Yes, we used to listen to that in a, in a car ride sometimes. Cool. Um, well, you I saved. think it's called like Crystal Lake or something. I don't even remember. It's good. Cool. Well, I guess that's a place to call it. Calming. For episode three. All right. You're making good progress. I think that's episode three. Yeah. Sweet. Join us for the conclusion <laughs> of Resident Evil. Is one. that your way of keeping people hooked? Just why? Well, I, I just don't know when how long the game is, so I genuinely assume that every episode could be the conclusion. You could beat it in like ten minutes. Really? Is there a secret? No, you don't know. I don't know. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, again, don't forget to like and subscribe to these videos so we can make more of them. Also, uh, uh, put it in the comments. What you guys like, uh, what you want to see more of. If you guys want us to post these at a different time, that always helps because we are winging it. Uh, I will be back again next week with Mike Mahardy playing more Resident Evil. Thanks for watching.